Okay, hi everyone. I just bought a Rhythm Fun treadmill. So I thought that I would do a quick little review for anybody who is considering purchasing one. So here's how it looks. This is exactly how it came. So it was in kind of a big box, but it's not too, it's not very heavy. I think it's about 74 pounds. So not too bad. Um, here's what it came with. Obviously the instruction manual. It comes with two remote controls. This is how you turn it on and off, which I will show you in just a little bit. It comes with two lubrication bottles, which you use to lubricate the treadmill. And I will also show you that. So it comes with two of those. And then it comes with this little toolkit. <clears throat> that you can use to tighten the belt kind of as, as you use it. Um, it stretches out a little bit so you can tighten the belt if need be. So again, here's how it looks. I paid a little over $500. I believe it was about $510 for it. So not too bad. Um, but I decided on this one because some of the other ones I was looking at only went four miles an hour. And I wanted something that went just a little bit faster than that. So you just plug it in and then there's a switch here that you turn on. Then it has the display for you. So you grab the remote and I'll show you kind of how it works. So the middle button is start and stop. The plus is to increase speed and the minus is to decrease speed. So when you start it, it counts down and it starts at 0.8 miles an hour. So the display is calories, distance, time, and then your speed. So I'll just show you kind of how the sound is on it as you turn it up. So this is about four miles an hour. As you can see, it's not too loud. It's a little bit louder when you walk on it, of course. But it does go up to six miles an hour, which I really like. I really appreciate just in case you want to do like a quick walk or a, you know, little jog. So then to turn it off, you just hit the middle button and it slows down for you and then stops. And the nice thing about this is it has wheels in the front. So right there, and you can just lift it up and wheel it to wherever you may wanna take it. Um, I probably will store it under our bed, which is really nice. You can just move it out of the way. Um, and then the final thing to lubricate the treadmill, like I said with this, there's just a tiny little spot, a little slot on the side here. And you just open it up and put about a third of this in the hole. Um, as needed. So it's dependent on how frequently you use the treadmill. So I've walked about three miles on it and my partner has walked a couple miles on it as well. We both really enjoy it so far, but obviously it's still pretty new. So we're really enjoying it as of right now, I would recommend, but I don't, I can't offer a long-term review on it as I just got it yesterday. I hope that helps and let me know if you have any other questions. Thanks.